I'm Elpinor of Kira. My prized possession was stolen and brought to Ithaca. Penelope's woven shroud. I need you to steal it back. All right. I'll do it. Don't fail. Headed to the house of Odysseus on a tiny boat. Let's try not to piss Poseidon off, shall we? I should be extra careful in this area. All the years I've lived on Kefalonia, I never realized the mighty Odysseus's palace was here. The legendary shroud. Elpinor wasn't lying. Oh, what now? Penelope shroud in the flesh. Uh, I mean cloth. I want to. Alexius, good news, I hope. Safe and sound. Well done. And now the shroud is yours. You don't want it? After all that? I gained something more valuable today. For your troubles, Mistheus. If I knew any better, I'd think you were testing me. Perhaps. You did well, Mistyus. Tell me, how do you feel about killing a general in Megaris? Do this for me and earn double what you earned today. Are you up to the task? It would take you far away from Kefalonia. So far away, you might never return. I'm not an assassin. There's a first time for everything. What do you say? Who is this general? They call him the Wolf. He do something to offend you? Yes, he's costing me drachmi. He's not good for business. Why me? 
Because no one knows who you are. You're invisible. Anything I should know about Megaris? Only that it's the most valuable land in the Greek world. From a military perspective, of course. Unfortunately for Megarians, it has two very powerful neighbors who just can't seem to play nice. In the tug of war between Corinth and Athens, Megaris is the rope. I accept. Splendid. You'll need a boat. You have one, don't you? If I had a boat, we wouldn't be having this conversation. A shame. It's too far of a swim, I'm afraid. Even for you. I'll find one. Good. I hope it's sturdy. And why is that? The seas are much more dangerous, I'm afraid. War is coming, and the wolf is on the wrong side. War? With who? The entire Greek world is at each other's throats. What rock have you been hiding under, exactly? Kefalonia. And how do I know you're on the right side? Because I'm the one paying you. You won't be disappointed. When your job in Megaris is done, come find me at Pilgrim's Landing in Fokis. I need a boat. I should go see the shipbuilder. It's a fine ship, Telemenes. Alexios! She is that. Ready to ride the waves for the right captain and the right price. I really need a boat, Telemenes. Everyone in Kafalonia needs a boat. Or passage on one. You've seen this shit hole. All my life. Even if I had a boat, who's going to row it? You. <laughs> I'd give my left grape to see that. This is Kefalonia. I could always find someone down on their luck and willing to work for next to nothing to get off this island. The seas are treacherous now. Well, more than usual. It would be suicide. You're not being very helpful, Telemenes. Not sure if this helps. But rumor has it the Cyclops is coming for you and Marcos. Malaka. How is that helpful? That monster held Kefalonia captive for too long. I figure if anyone could finally rid us of his stents, it would be you. Telemenes, what does this have to do with my need for a boat? Rumor also has it the Cyclops has docked his ship in Kleptus Bay. His ship, you say? I'll have to pay Kleptus Bay a visit. Be careful. That one-eyed brute has a nasty temper. So I can take his ship and deal with the Cyclops at the same time. Two birds, one stone. The Cyclops. Time to have a little chat. They won't ask any questions. Best keep out of sight. This used to be a nice village, but now it's just a nest of anarchy and crime. as my witness, I swear! Which one? What difference does it make? <laughs> All 
of them! I swear, all of them! I have never heard so much fucking god talk from one man in all my days! <gasps> Let him go. No one on this island is allowed to say that word! Did he say Cyclops? Did it hurt your feelings? I don't like it when people call me that! Um, oh, I didn't. I... <gasps> but you're so... fat. I mean, big and strong. You really do only have one eye. Oh, my eye. Give it to me. Give it to me and I won't kill Marcos for having you steal it! Give it to me! You want it? Go get it. We shouldn't delay here any further. Even rats like these have friends on Kefalonia. By Zeus! These Kefalonian bandits are no joke! Good thing you're on my side! They really seem to fear you! Die! Ah! 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 And thank you enough. After spending most of my life at sea, it would have been absolutely shameful to drown in a pot. Ah, where are my manners? I am Varnavas, captain of the Adrestia. Well, Varnavas, I'm pleased to meet you. I'm Alexios, Mystios by trade. <laughs> oh, but you're much more than that, I'm sure. What do you mean? When they forced my head underwater, I prayed to the gods. And when they pulled it out, there you were! All of Kefalonia heard your prayers. I just happened to be closest. <laughs> and you just happened to fight like Achilles, while Zeus's eagle flies around your head. So why were those men attacking you? Oh, you know the people here. No offense. I tell them a tale of my last voyage, and the next thing I know, they're acting like a bunch of savages. What tale could you tell that would make them so angry? My last voyage, we found a man floating alone on a raft. Before he passed, he told us a tale to make your blood run cold. Something about a horrifying creature, ugly beyond description. I mentioned the words, one-eyed monster. Next thing I know, I'm drowning in a clay pot. Yes, the Cyclops tends to take that personally. Where do you come from? Everywhere, nowhere. The Adrestia is my home, but I was born in an olive grove in Mykonos. I haven't stepped foot there since I left for the military. So you're a soldier? I was. My brothers and I were captains in the Athenian fleet, until one night during a siege, Poseidon's fury destroyed our ships. That was the night I saw it. It? What did you see? 
The Sea God commands more than just the winds and the waves when he truly unleashes his temper. I saw his beast, his murderous pet. Few believe me, but this dead eye is a permanent reminder. Punishment for looking on Poseidon's forbidden creature and living to tell the tale. So you have a ship? Of course. Gods forbid I'd end up stuck in this place. Where is it now? Thanks to you, it's still in Sami Harbor, where I left it. Perhaps the fates brought us together after all. I'm in need of a ship and a crew. <laughs> you saved my life! It would disgust the gods to not offer it in return. So that's a yes? My ship, my crew, and my services are yours. You truly aren't from around here. Ha <laughs> ha! Gods, no! And I thank them for that! Come now and see the Adrestia! We are ready when you are, Captain! Wait! Wait for me, Alexios. I'm all packed and everything. You're coming, are you? If you're going, I'm going. Phoebe, you're not old enough. I can't look after you all the time. I can look after myself. I don't need anyone to help me. Even if that were true, it's not your time. But there wouldn't be any trouble. Promise. If I can't come, then take Hara. Hara? My pet eagle. She's my friend. Mater gave her to me. But she'll be your friend now. And it'll be like I'm there with you. You know, to remind you of me. Thanks, Phoebe. But you have to promise we'll see each other again. I promise. You haven't seen the last of me. Just stay out of trouble until then. I will. Don't worry. Okay, you can leave now. Alexios! Leaving Kefalonia without saying goodbye to your dear Marcos? Tell me it isn't true. Well, you're here now, so it won't be true. Goodbye, Marcos. All these years as a dynamic duo! I'll never replace you! Well, I may need another assistant someday, but it won't be easy. Come now, give me a hug. <sighs> All right, come here. Yes, bring it in. Oh, will I ever miss you, Alexios? Thanks, Marcos. I'll miss you too. And what does the future hold for you? Wine, of course. Though you never know when the vines will wither. I'm always ready for another adventure. Speaking of adventure, I have a task for you, dear Phoebe. An adventure? Yes! Already following in your footsteps, isn't she, my friend? Ready to set sail? Prepare to cast off. It's time to leave. Good! The tides wait for neither man nor woman. Time to go. So, what course do we set? Where in this big, beautiful world does the mighty Alexios want to go? Megaris. <laughs> Megaris? But we'll be sailing into war. I got a contract for some general's head. Whose head? They call him the Wolf. The Wolf? Who wants Nikolaos of Sparta dead? Nikolaos of Sparta? The Oracle has spoken! <laughs> to prevent Sparta's fall, the child must fall first. No! no. no. Murderer! He has killed Toss him! him over. Pay for his dishonor, for the life he has snuffed. Look he is no me, spot in Nicholas. Don't. <laughs> Don't listen, Nicholas. Father, Nicholas, stop, Nicholas. Nicolas, look at me! Look at me, Nicolas! Don't! Don't listen! Your blood is 
contains it! Rid yourself of this poison! Butter? <laughs> Alexios! Get me to Megaris. Now. But I don't understand. Of all the places under Ilios, why risk our necks to go there? The wolf of Sparta is my father. <laughs>